Okay, I'm back. Today we went to a toy and collectible show in Brantford. Uh, they didn't really have cards. They had a little bit. I put a short on my uh, YouTube. They had two tables with some cards, not much. Uh, the wife loves the Funko Pops. They had millions of those. So if you're into those, a lot of these local shows lately are loaded with Funkos. But... We went to my little secret uh, location and I found three bricks of these 81 or 1982, 83 Opeachy cards. So let's open those for fun and see what we can find. I paid uh, $14 all in per, per brick. I've bought these from this vendor before from various uh, years and sets. Sometimes I had a hit something pretty good. Sometimes mostly just base, but still fun. I find these don't last, so I figured I'd stop in to see if there was a new ones. And sure enough, there was. Okay, let's do the first brick. Right on the top, we got a Bork. Third year Bork. There we go. Ken Houston. Okay, we'll just go through these. There it is, right off the bat, Mr. Tiger Williams makes an appearance. All right. Harold Snips. I'm guessing in these, we're going to get a lot of doubles. I'll try to go through these quick since I have three of them. Let's see if we can find a uh, Francis or a Fuhr or one of the cards you see in the back there. Kind of motor through these. I think there's like maybe six or 700 cards here. Actually, this set, Oilers, Whalers, and Jets, I guess. Or there could be, you know, you could get a Bossy or... Lafleur, but those are the teams you kind of want to kind of want to get some Jets cards here. Brian Ingblom doubles. Ted Bully. There he is again, Tiger. Let's do the count. There's two. Brad Maxwell, Morris Lukowicz. He was a good player. Yeah, 90, coming off a 92-point season there. Pretty good. Still lots of guys with no helmets back then. Pat Riggin. He was an all-star a couple times, maybe. There's the ugly uh, Cooper All Pants. So this year, they're going to do uh, third jerseys or retro or whatever but they're gonna wear these uh cooper all pants in the warm-ups only not in the game i think it was hartford and washington as well might have wore them at some point i know i have or have had cards that show them wearing them some islanders here all these multiple cup winning guys um, legendary helmet there, Mr. Goring. Mario Tremblay. Dale McCourt. Let's see what his numbers were like. He had 86 points, season 81. Could be worse, right? Rick Middleton. Pretty good player there. Borderline Hall of Famer, not quite. comes the whalers francis slipped through the cracks again merlin there's merlin nope there's the oilers did fear slip through the cracks there's the rat kenny lindsman with the airbrush helmet mm. he could put, put up points though he's coming off a 92 point season here there's a few more oilers in the next stack
John Okorodnik. I think he had 50 one year. Pretty sure. Tim Waters. Reg Kerr. Doubles. Yeah, this is a lot of cards. It's probably going to be a 20-minute job. Kent Nielsen, another great player. Don Edwards, the backup. Mad Mel. He always kind of had the crazy eyes. Scary looking. Tony McKegney. He was a pretty good player too. Yep. The Leaper, Mike Felino. Here's a nice uh, miscut or marker card. Steve Casper, and we finish with this guy got six assists in one game as a record. All right, let's do the second brick. Let's see if I can get this open. Easier, maybe not. So I'm filming this on a Saturday before the Sports Card Expo is coming up next week. I can't wait. I have a list of uh, things I want to look for and I'll try to film some good content, maybe some live reels or shorts. It's going to be fun. I got a Friday pass. All right. Next stack. Fred Arthur. Kurt Giles. I think he was captain for a while. Let's move this stack over. Dwight Foster. Blake Wesley. He was a decent defenseman. No, that's Glenn Wesley. Maybe his brother. Not sure. Looks like him. More flyers or whalers, but not the right one. Mike Rogers, another uh, another guy that had a sh shit ton of points. Yeah, 300 point seasons in a row to start his NHL career. That was pretty awesome. A lot of these guys, like WHA guys like Hedberg, were fairly underrated players. Forgotten. I always, uh, always laugh at this helmet. Robbie Fitorik. Bob Nystrom, Ken Morrow, the same Islanders guys. This is probably what's going to happen. We're going to get most of the same. There's Dave Semenko. There's the Rat. Lee Fogelin, the captain. Kind of funny to see because, look, he's right there with... Uh, 99, but for a few years it was this guy. And you're like, who? Career high on this says 30 points. Oh, he was a defenseman. Then uh, I guess soon after Gretzky took the reins. All right, let's keep motoring. Tom Lysiak. I always tell that story. He got suspended for tripping the referee. He's kind of funny. Oh, I think it was a face-off, and he just completely tripped the referee on purpose. Got 20 games. The things you remember from when you were younger, but you can't remember what you had for breakfast. Okay, another stack. Some Jets. Willie Lindstrom, Morris Lukowicz again. Yeah, same kind of, same coalition pretty much. Doubles, doubles. There he is, number three. Maybe we'll get four. <laughs> I'm going to guess we're going to get another one. Pretty funny. Mark Tardif, he was pretty good too. I think he went to WHJ, came back. Yep. Some big seasons. Another guy here. 
Andre Dupont. No, I'm thinking of Andre Lacroix. Rick Kehoe. 55 goal season in 80-81. Surprise. Okay, next up. Similar guys. Oh, here comes Tiger Williams, maybe. Nope, not this time. Next stack. Dennis Heron. This is in between uh, Dryden and Patrick Waugh. They had some uh, not-so-famous goalies, I guess. John Tonelli again. These guys again. Brad Marsh. No helmet. Blake Wesley. Pierre LaRouche. He was highly, highly touted at one point, this guy. He, he did have 100-point season in the beginning of his career. Had some, looks like a few really short seasons. I think injuries and stuff got in the way for that guy. A lot of doubles here. A lot of doubles. Okay, one more brick to go. Let's see if we can do it under 15 minutes. I think the cards you see in the background, I think that's the four biggest cards in the set. There's also a whole bunch of other leader Gretzkys in, in action. Gretzky. Trophy winner Gretzkys. There's like nine Gretzkys. A lot of 80s sets are like that for... For Mr. Wayne. Okay. Last one. Let's see what we can find. There's those beautiful uh, Cooperalls again. Morris Lukowicz again. Dave Babich. Yeah, we're going to get the same coalition. And sure enough, we got another one. Mr. Tiger Williams. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, five. Wow. Five Tigers. Thomas Gradine. This guy was a good player, too. In action, doesn't show his stats, but he was good. There's the old coach, Crawford. Look at these uniforms, eh? These home ones. I think these are home from back then. Brian Sutter, captain already back then. Six Sutter brothers in the league at the time. I think two sets of twins, I think. Mark Tardif. Anton Stastny, he was a good player, obviously. Jacques Richard, another solid player. 103 points. John Garrett. Riel Cloutier, another guy. Lots of points. Randy Carlisle, he... Uh, oh, this one's a little destroyed. He won a couple of Norris trophies. Maybe one. I think one. Bill Barber. Yep, yep, lots of doubles. Mike McEwen, all these guys. Ron Duguay with the with the hair. Okay, a few more to go. Reggie Leach. Uh, 60 goals and I think uh, losing Con Smythe trophy winner. Yes, he was. Steve Shutt, another 60 goal guy. To look at the backs of these cards, I see some uh, paper loss, unfortunately. Here comes the the whalers and the oilers. Oh, faint hope, faint hope. But nope. Ken Lindsman, we've had four or five of him. Ron Lowe. Paul Coffey, there's a decent card in action. Ah, not so decent. <laughs> oh, whatever.
Tom Lysiak again. Yeah, these are like the same three bricks, basically a few, a few different uh, cards mixed in. And that is all. So like I said, next week, uh, big, big Friday coming up next week with the card show. So guaranteed to have a lot of pickups and some live stuff. Maybe I will be posting all that stuff. So, uh, hit the like, hit the subscribe, stay tuned.